So I figured out my headset is not connecting the mic. Like there's a mic in my headset, but it's not connecting to my iPad. And I'm using the iPad to film. So I think that's why the sound is so poor. But I've changed the setup now and I've put it away from the wind and I'm pushing myself here. I'm hoping the sound's gonna concentrate. So let me know if that sounds better. Uh, I'll listen to it before I upload it just today. I get tired at times. As you can see, the, the autopilot is still working today. Uh, I'm lucky. Started working at, uh, at around 10.30 yesterday because it, it stopped again yesterday. So it, it comes back, it goes, it comes back, it goes. Does it all the time. It's been working for, anyway, all day, all night, uh, and, and a good a, a chunk of the morning. I did 140 miles yesterday, which is not bad considering that you know sometimes I I just turn around. The, the wind is still not at an ideal angle, so I'm I'm heading west to try to get some. Uh, there's not a lot of wind in the ITCZ right now. I'm just like about 80 miles north of the start of the entered tropical conversion zones, which is that zone that doesn't have a lot of wind. So I'm staying north of it, and I'm heading west to try to go west of the wind lulls, but at some point I won't be able to carry on that way because uh, I, yeah, I need some wind angle to get through there. The good news is there's supposed to be wind in it like pretty much starting today and all week and it's going to increase through the week and I just need um, I just need two solid days of wind in there uh, and I, hopefully like I'll be able to keep the autopilot and set up my spinnaker and once the spinnaker is up then you know 150 miles per day hopefully for one time of this trip uh, on, a, on a beam reach and I should be south of the equator and once I'm south of the equator then I'll know pretty much exactly in a, in a kind of narrow time frame uh, how, when and how I'm gonna get to the Marquesas. Uh, I still have 1250 miles to go uh, so a bit less than half it's, uh, it's still a long trip uh, but good news is I got some sun today. I had a good, a fair amount of sun yesterday also. So the battery got topped up well. I'll see how that behaves. I still have a lot of fuel. And if the wind is as forecasted for me to cross the ITCZ, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get to the Marquesas with an excess of fuel. Like right now, I, I burnt uh, only uh, six and a half hours of fuel out of, a, out of a potential of 55 hours that I have in the tanks right now. So, uh, so I still, uh, other, other said, like I, I still have 48 hours of uh, usable fuel. Uh, the rest of it, like I, I would still have fuel after 48 hours of motoring. Uh, just after that, like I, I, I consider that reserve. So if I need it, then I need to go reach the wind south of the equator. I, I could still like burn 48 hours of fuel to do that. And right now it doesn't look like I'll need it. So we'll see how all that evolves.